I want to give you this two scriptures. What must the motivation of the church be? Five things. Matthew chapter number 22, verse 37. The Bible says, Jesus said, You shall love the Lord with all of your heart, all of your soul, and all of your mind. This is the first and greatest commandment. And the second one is, You shall love your neighbor as you love yourself. Two things there, love the Lord. Second thing, love your neighbor. Loving the Lord is what? It is worship. So we have to have a culture of number one, worship. Number two, loving your neighbor, what is that? That is ministry. So when we worship him, he pours his love into us. When we carry his love, now we get to minister. Because now we carry his love. Number one, we worship him. Number two, we do ministry. Then the second scripture I want to go to, Matthew chapter number 28, is a great commission. Go into all the world and what? Make, what is that? Go into all the world. That is evangelism. Number three, we must evangelize. Then it says, baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. What is that? That is number four, if you want writing it down, fellowship. When you baptize someone, they die. But when you bring them up, they get risen in something. So they die to something, and they get risen into something. So we bring them into the family. So now we fellowship with them. So number one, we worship. Number two, ministry. Number three, what do we do? Go evangelism. Number four, we bring them into the family, fellowship. And then number four, we have to what? Teach them. What is that called? We have to make disciples. I believe this must be the motivation, this must be the culture of the church. Worship, ministry, evangelism, number four, fellowship, and making disciples.